What's up, YouTube? This is hashtag Just a Dad, and this is my first video. I am actually I don't have all the fancy software and stuff to make videos. Again, this is my first one. I just wanted to take the time to show you what I did to make it easier for me to tote this little Bass Raider 10E around. I built a little dolly that makes it easy for me to move the boat around. So hang on, I'll tell you how I did it. So as you can see, I've taken the boat off the dolly here, and the dolly was actually very simple to build. I went to Home Depot or Lowe's, whatever, and I bought a 2x6 board, which is this right here. Um, it was much longer, but I cut it to size. What I did was I eyeballed it basically, and I measured out to see where I wanted the wheels to stand out on the side of the boat without actually rubbing the boat, and um, that's how I cut it. I can give you the measurements. In fact, I might do that. Um, I'm not using any, as I said, any fancy uh, video graphic stuff because I'm not savvy enough for that. But in any event, um, what I did was I went to Home Depot and I bought the board, cut down a size. These pieces right here that you see, the white, the two white pieces, are actually the rubber bottoms for furniture so that you don't scuff up your wood floors. Um, and I screwed uh, those into the board at about the same distance uh, from the pontoon so that when I put my uh, dolly underneath it'll actually match up to the pontoons as you can see. The tires are actually from a bicycle, little girl's bicycle that I purchased for about ten dollars from a uh, neighbor here in the neighborhood and um, it was actually pink, the rims were pink so that wasn't manly enough so I painted them green. Um, and then the, the little brackets here are little L brackets you can see that right here. Um, it's a pretty thick, I'd say uh, maybe a sixteenth of an inch thick uh, steel. They're brackets from Home Depot uh, in the wood section. I think they're used for uh, possibly fencing um, and any L bracket would actually work. You just need something where the hole is big enough so that when you use your wheels for the bicycle, um, it'll go in and you can screw it in. It's very simple. I use the same hardware from the bicycle itself, the bolts, um, and they just bolted right on. Uh, why did I build it this way instead of putting casters on the bottom? Well, I'll show you. If I'm by myself, um, all I do is just set this down and it balances out. So I don't need to worry about if you've got the casters on the bottom, the board will sit there and rock, rock, rock back and forth and I didn't want to deal with that. So by doing it this way, all I do set it down and I can simply just put the boat on. Now I know what you're asking, what are the two little bars for? This was actually a one piece um, deal, I don't even bracket I guess, from Harbor Freight that I bought um, and it was actually curved around like that. What I did was I cut it to size, I flattened it out and I screwed it in, but these are usually used for mounting stuff up on, on walls. That was maybe a I don't know, I think it was like $3 at Harbor Freight or so, somewhere around there, uh, extremely cheap. Um, and the reason I have that right there is because when I put my, when I put the Bash Raider on, the purpose of these is so that they'll hook in to these little portions here. So when I put my boat on here uh, and I'm pulling it around, the grip that I get from the rubber feet and these two hooking onto the bottom of the boat um, is good enough so that I don't have to strap the boat down to the board. I simply just put the boat on here and I'm good to go. And I'll show you how I do that. Okay, so before I go on any further, uh, some of y'all have noticed that I've got my iPhone in hand. Um, the reason for that, again, I don't have any fancy uh, software or anything. I'm using an iPad and my iPhone is because I'm using an app called ScoreCam. It's actually for sports. I record my daughter's volleyball games, but um, I'm able to pause and play and then later on stop it. So I guess that's fancy, fancy for me. But uh, that's why I have the phone in hand. Anyhow, I'm gonna put the phone down. I'm gonna show you how I put my boat on my dolly. And here we go. Basically, I just put that anywhere, lay the boat down, get my dolly, lift the boat up a little bit, Slide it under, and I'm good to go. Now I'll come to the front, pick it up, and I can move it around. 
there's no issues makes it easy for me to move my boat around if I'm going out fishing by myself no I'm not an angler um, in fact truth be told I've only gone fishing about three times and the only thing I've managed to catch was a turtle about the yay big so anyhow I hope this helps if you have any questions leave me a comment and I'll get back to you till then enjoy your fishing